darlings. Tonight I have an anonymous request which is, Hey Lord Thronduil, I heard stories that your people only eat meat. Is this true? Wouldn't consuming copious amounts of wine contradict this? Love one curious hobbit. Not only are you curious, it seems that you have really been digging into some very old, old books if you found out about this. Um, it, it's true historically, Sylvan Elves, and, and this we're talking ages ago, um, there was a prohibition on consuming plant matter because of course plants are all very sacred um, to the Sylvan Elves, and so for, for, for many many centuries um, it was prohibited to, to consume any plants. So as a result, it, it was um, sort of a meat-only diet. And, and that's changed over many years. You know, my own father sort of lifted that restriction when he took over. And, um, you know, personally, I'm, I'm not um, a Sylvan elf. I'm, I'm Sindar. So I'm not held to the same sort of strict regulations um, that, that would have been in place centuries ago. Now, um, it's true that, that the, the Sylvan diet is still um, very heavy in meat, which is, is very different from many other elves. Um, but, you know, we, we try to sort of incorporate many different cultures and ways of thinking, and so um, there's not sort of the, the strict penalties that were in place for, um, for what was once considered desecrating any um, plant matter. So. Um, so now that's allowed, and of course, being Sindar, it would have been fine anyhow for me, but, um, you know, we've changed a lot of things, and, um, you know, that's, that was hardly the most extreme of sort of the things that came up, particularly funerary rites. I'm not even going to go into those, because I, I, I think it's best for us to continue to move on, but, um, but I, I am quite impressed that you, you found this little bit of, of history here that um, hasn't been going on for, for many centuries, um, I don't think at all since very early in the Third Age, maybe even the end of the Second. It, you know, time sort of flies by and it's hard to keep um, track of it all. But thank you so much for your question, darling. I hope that answers everything that you had. And if you have any further questions, of course, feel free to ask them. Ta-ta.